Hello, welcome to GTEC Techno Solution. Today we are going to discuss about problems on numbers. Indeed, we have a few problems on numbers which are having very good solutions. Let us see. These are some of the basic formulae which you have to know in order to solve the problems based on numbers. We have our first formula over here which says a plus b into a minus b is nothing but a square minus b square. A second formula says that a plus b the whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab. A third formula says that a minus b the whole square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab. Well, we have a fourth interesting formula over here which says that a plus b plus c the whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2 into ab plus bc plus ca. A fifth formula over here states that a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b into a square minus ab plus b square. A sixth formula over here says that a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b into a square plus ab plus b square. A seventh formula over here says that a cube plus b cube plus c cube minus 3 a b c is equal to a plus b plus c into a square plus b square plus c square minus a b minus b c minus a c. Our eighth formula says that when a plus b plus c is equal to 0 then a cube plus b cube plus c cube is nothing but 3 a b c. If you see over here your eighth formula is obtained by substituting a plus b plus c is equal to 0 in the right hand side of your 7th formula. Anything multiplied by 0 is 0 hence a cube plus b cube plus c cube is equal to 3 a b c. Moving on we have our first interesting example over here which says that we have a positive number which when increased by 17 it will be equal to 60 times the reciprocal of the number. We have our options over here as a 3 b 10 c 17 and d 20. So as you can see, this is an important question as these pattern of questions are asked in bank exam and TCS exams. Now let us see how to solve this. Let a number which is positive be x. So the reciprocal of the number will be nothing but 1 by x. And it is given that when a positive number is increased by 17 that is x plus 
17 will give you 60 times the reciprocal of the number that is nothing but 60 into 1 by x hence we got our first equation that is x plus 17 is equal to 60 into 1 by x multiplying 60 inside you get x plus 17 is equal to 60 by x multiplying your x to the left hand side you get x into x plus 17 is equal to 60 Multiplying your x inside, you get x square plus 17x minus 60 is equal to 0. And solving it further, you can write 17 as 20 minus 3. That is, x square plus 20x minus 3x minus 60 is equal to 0. As you can see over here, you have your x to be common in this term and you have a common factor of 3 in this term take it outside so you have x into x plus 20 minus 3 into x plus 20 over here you can see that x plus 20 is common in both the terms, so take it outside. You'll get x plus 20 into x minus 3. From this equation, you can get that your x has the value as either minus 20 or 3. So, we should take the positive value because we have a number as a positive number. So, x should be a positive number. Hence, a value of x is 3, which is option A. Hence, option A is our answer.